every time I see these guys on my FYP, I think to myself, man, these guys just don't get it. But it's okay. But North and South is pretty important. Now, Aotearoa and Hawaii is the most remarkable one to me because there is no physical marker of Tonga to the south of Aotearoa. But they still use the word south. Tonga is still the word south in the Maori language. Being very detailed on your coordinates and your directions is, is really critical, right? So it wasn't purely like what you said. When you're in the middle of the ocean and you're you trying to figure out where North is and Tokelau, where we're Tonga, it's it's more sophisticated than that. Yes. So yes, that's what I'm saying because each island had a certain constellation of stars to get them directly where that island. Because if we just go, okay, this is making sure this is North or South. If you're coming from Manua, you're gonna miss. You're gonna be hitting New Way, and you're gonna be like Columbus. When he goes to the newfound world saying this is India and they call Named him India. India. And that's and that's the thing is so number one, that the cardinal direction doesn't make sense because like we we're saying, Manua, you're gonna totally miss Tonga. No, I was gonna say that usually like what you said, <laughs> the Polynesians don't have a room to make mistakes when they're traveling between islands. Because if you if yeah. you miss something, you're gonna starve and most likely die. And that was part of the reason why the Polynesian physically has one of the strong physical traits than probably most other ethnic groups because usually only the strongest survive it's That's difficult what, difficult yeah. hard on the body yeah.